Hey everybody. Well, it is Thursday evening. So, thought I'd take some time and do a bunch of my journaling stuff. So, here we are. Pull that out of there. And get a couple days done. So, let's see what I got. Oh yeah, I had left off with Tuesday and um, I, you remember I said I was going to Chili's and um, this is the bag that they put the silverware in a bag, which is really cool. So I was pretty happy to get that. Okay, so we have, I don't have a whole lot for yesterday. Um, here's yesterday and I think I might as well trim that off. Today I wrote to the edges for today's, but yesterday I can shorten up that page a little bit. So let's see, yesterday it got to 41 and it was cloudy all day. And we did have a little bit of misty kind of rain stuff. Um, in the morning, not a lot, you know, um, just a little misty. Let's put this over here, I think. There we go. That's nice. Ugh, smearing my, looks like I got a little glue. So, let's just clean that off a little. <sighs> okay. There we go. Yeah, I had <laughs> changed something I had written ahead of time that I was going to do, and then I ended up changing it, so I have that there. And I might just um, put something there to cover it up. Let's see. Let me see what I got. I'm sure I have something I can put there. Maybe, will a snow globe fit? No, but the snow globe goes in really well with something I did. So let's just put this ornament across there. Then it kind of sort of looks like on purpose, even if it wasn't. Anyway, um, work wasn't super busy, uh, but I, I did manage to fill my time somehow. And then I, I read, I got home and I read until my husband got home. And then we had um, fish, fish for supper. And I'm trying to get some paper here. Um, and watch Wheel of Fortune. And then um, my husband went geocaching, so I watched Elf because he doesn't really care for that movie. And I finished it almost the whole thing before he got home. And then um, we still had some layered jello, so we had that for snack, and that's finally done. And I just read some before bed, and that was it. I'd, I'd been dealing with a headache all afternoon, or since I got home all night. I mean, it, it didn't go away till I went to sleep, so such is life. I think I just need one page for today, for yesterday, because there's not a lot going on. And I need to see if the stamp is one I have. So let's go back to my stamp page. I don't have that one. Cool. So we'll get that put on the book. Yeah, so there wasn't a whole lot going on. Um, I was trying to make do this necklace. I got this this locket that my friend Kathy gave me. I was trying to string it onto this chain I have that's the right color, but the chain is um, this part that goes in here is too thick. So I'm, I just need to work on this, figure this out. Um, if it's too thick to work, um, yeah. I don't know. We'll figure out what to do later. 
But I did bring that out and I thought, well, I could put that here. Or I'll just save it for today since I'm going to do today's all in one spot since there wasn't a whole lot um, to put here. But maybe what I'll do is put a few things around that are kind of Christmassy for the, for the fun of it. Put that there. I think that's cute. Just super simple. All right, so let's let's just get some washi in. Maybe since we got the blues, we'll just kind of stick with this blue blue theme. I've been thinking about how I want to do my Christmas journal, which you guys have seen me working a little bit in it, but I was thinking that I wanted to approach it a little differently. So I have been thinking about that. And I think what I'm gonna do is like where I have journaling cards and such, I will use those for the journaling. And then I'm going to decorate the pages with some of the cute things I've gotten or I have that I really like that um, I think would work nice for Christmas. That's my thought. Okay, so this doesn't want to stick, so we will encourage it to stick. So that's really all I want to do for this page. And then um, for today, uh, it did get up to 32 today, but it was definitely a colder day. Um, we had our work lunch, um, and that was at Devani's. And so we brought, we all had uh, ordered what we wanted and brought it in today. But anyway, before I get to that, um, I got to work and I managed to keep fairly busy. And then I, Michael's was having a 70% off all their Christmas stuff today. So Mandy let me run in and go and get some stuff. So I want to show you what I got. So this is normally $5 roll, I think. And this is a $10 roll. And they were, oh, they're both 10. But anyway, they were 70% off, which means I paid like $3 for, look at this beautiful snowflake ribbon. And then I really like this ribbon for nature journals and this for my winter journals. And then I got, I wanted glass ornaments for my tree to fill in some spots. And I got these, and these were 70% off. So really good deal. And they're just beautiful ornaments, beautiful glass ornaments. So I'm super happy about that. And then I needed some small ones, so I ended up getting these plastic ones. But look at how well they match with what's already here. So I'm just going to have to figure out how to get these out of here very carefully without breaking them. I'm not going to touch them right now. <laughs> but I thought the blues would be a nice change from what I usually go with. Alright, so... Then, um... My boss gave me a willow tree figurine, a girl holding a thank you sign, and she gave me a super sweet, pretty card, really, really nice, like really nice of her. And then um, here's some of the wrapping paper. Isn't this wrapping paper great? So, and then I have like the thing from the willow tree figurine, and um, there are actually two of these in there. So I thought I would do a little bit of this. And I think I'm just going to cut like this and then figure out the best way to put this on. But it's such cute paper. It really is. Alright, so but maybe I could kind of go like this and 
I would just um, do it all like that. And then set it on here. And then thought it might be fun just to um, just bring it back over this way. And I have this piece. I can just fit this back the way it's supposed to be. But I just thought if I went like that, that would, you know, let's just put the the whole piece on and it makes a nice backdrop for my pages so I'm just going to and then I'll just cut whatever um, doesn't doesn't work I'm not gonna worry too much about it okay so what I'm gonna do is put this here anyway we had our work lunch uh, not work lunch, but our Christmas lunch. So we all ordered what we wanted, and then we just sat in the conference room and had a nice hour visiting and just having an enjoyable time. It was really good, really, really nice. Um, so let's go like this, I think. Like that. This, yeah, I think that will work. Mm -hmm. And then I can just trim off this extra. Oh, I need to trim off. And um, then, um, and that was about it for the day. Um, it made it a really, it really did make it for uh, to be a nice day. I think. To made it special and you know that's always good so, yeah so I'm just trimming up the this wherever it looks like it went over okay then I want to put the card um, do I want the card here I think I do so I'm just going to uh, Okay, is that done? It looks like it might be. So yeah. All right. So I'm just going to put the card maybe oh, what do I want to do? You know what? I I'm going to put the card here. Because that one's a little more beat up anyway. And then here I'm going to put the Devani's thing. Okay. I'll just put it like this. And that looks like it fits pretty good. I just have to take off um, a little bit, it looks like. Or, oh, hmm. Yeah, not too much. Just a small little spot. There we go. Okay. Alright. So, and then, um,. I have that willow tree thing, and I'm thinking oh, it's so cute. I kind of like to wonder if I can oops, ah, didn't want to do that. This is why you use removable stuff. Okay, so I'm just going to put this one up here because I want to tuck this cute little, I want to tuck this in there. 
because it's just for you with sincere thanks. So cute. So I'm going to put that there, and then I'm just going to go ahead and put this other, the same one, but I'm just going to put it over here. So I like that. Yeah, so that turned out cute. And that's all I have to do for that. Now, um, yeah, so that takes care of the two days. Oh, except I didn't say anything about what else I was going to be doing today. Anyway, um, and I have to get it all on here. Got home and um, we made tacos for supper. And I watched Wheel of Fortune. And later I'll watch um, Next Generation. But I wanted to get some journaling done. And I might just go until my camera decides it's recorded enough. I don't know yet. We'll see what happens. But I wanted to get into some of my other stuff. But yeah, I, I think it turned out cute pages. However, let's um, need to... It's like it didn't glue as well as it should have. So let me see if I can kind of help it. I think that'll work. All right. And then maybe put something up here. Maybe we'll put a little candle down here. And let's see, what can we put up there? Hmm. <laughs> How about this? And then I didn't do any tape, so Let's see, let's do a little, let's do a little tape. Okay. And I think we'll just run this one up here. Okay. Yeah, and then we'll just watch an episode of Star Trek Next Generation tonight, and I'll read and stuff before before bed. Um, as far as the December Daily is going, I have to do some decorating, because I haven't. Like, I have this holiday baking thing, and I have not done anything, but... I do have some cute, like this is for like holiday baking, making like the cookies and stuff. So, thought could just use these stickers because they're so cute. And these are like oven mitts. And then this is like a cookie. And here's a gingerbread man. Oh, and we have a rolling pin. So here's a rolling pin and a gingerbread man. And I don't have room for the other cookie. You know, unless I remove this. Because I have another cookie here. So I could put that a little further down and put the sugar thing there. Yeah, I think that works. Okay. Yeah, so we did manage to do a little bit, right? All right, now, um, that was the 16th. See, I wrote, I did my writing. I just didn't finish up. Um, so I have some Christmas lights, like this. I thought would be kind of fun to, I mean, I don't, I'm not too worried about that. It's covering up some stuff because I, I can read what it, enough to know what it, what it's saying, so I'm not too worried. This one will just go like this. And, oops. 
And we'll just go like this with some more. Oops. These are um, also from Current. Not Current. Creative Memories, if you guys are uh, familiar with Creative Memories. And if I had these forever, you guys. Just such a long time I've had these. Alright, and oops, some of these are kind of fallen where I don't want them to. Alright, one more big one. See if I can get it off without getting things stuck all over me. Alright, let's see. It's a wonder these still peel off good because... Once stickers start getting old, it's super hard to do anything with them. But, okay. I consider it good if I can manage to um, actually start using up some of these stickers and get them spread around. Okay, so there's the lights, and then we have hot chocolate. And let's see, you guys know I have my little hot chocolate things like this, so I'm going to put that, I don't know, I'm going to put it here, but then do I have some Christmas words that would be fun to put on the pages? Well, we have Elvin approved. These were kind of sassy ones that I got. Um, at Michael's last year. Okay, so let's see. What else? Do I have anything else? Maybe because it's hot chocolate, I should put this cookie here. So I have a cookie with it. I'm going to leave it at that because I don't really I don't think I have let me just look real quick at my stickers but I don't think other than some stray gingerbread men <laughs> who can kind of go along here with this I don't really have a whole lot more, so we'll just throw some gingerbread men on the page. All right, and then the 19th, that was yesterday, and that was stockings, and hmm, do I have anything for stockings? Boy, I don't know if I do. Just kind of looking at all my stickers and there's a sled and wreaths and holly and all that kind of stuff. Some more wreaths, Christmas balls. Hmm. I don't think I have stockings. Oh, I have a stocking there. And some odds and ends of Christmas things. But I have one stocking, so we will use the one stocking that I have. Okay. And since I don't have anything else to go with that at all, I think I'm just going to take this washi and... Oh, did you see that I stuck that on the wrong page? You guys probably saw that immediately. Okay, so there we go. You know, that's okay then. Let's just leave that there. Um, then we have Today Was Favorite Ornament. And I do have something with ornaments, I think. Here we go. So 
so we can just do some ornaments around. Here's a star. Oh, come on. I think I can just kind of make some, do it this way, right? This bell, and then here's another star. We'll put that down there, and then here's a horn. I'm just going to consider all of these like ornaments because I don't have anything else. Okay. And ornaments, of course, go on the Christmas tree. So maybe if we throw a few little Christmas trees around, that would be nice, right? And some of these little shiny elements that look like decorations or lights or something. Anyway, it makes it a little festive, I think. So we'll just do a little decorating um, up here. Okay. And then tomorrow, I did write part of tomorrow. I did write tomorrow's. I took the word Mary and I wrote Merry Christmas and just wrote down some Christmas words that I felt like, you know, kind of went with it. So that's that. So we will count that enough for now. And then, um, let me see what kind of time I've got left. I'm at 26 minutes. I'm not going to hear that turn off. So if it turns off and I, I'm just going to keep talking and I won't discover it till the end. So Anyway, um, I was thinking I should just do some decorating. Um, I got pockets and stuff, and I can put things in some pockets. But some of this stuff is so adorable. Like, look at that. So I thought it would be kind of fun just to put this in here, and then someday I will journal on it. So that can become like a journaling spot right there. And I wanted to pull out the different things I had saved because I thought I could make some cute spreads with some of this. Because I really haven't thought about like how to use some of the stuff I have. Like, how cute is this paper? So I was thinking about that and thinking it would be nice just to like uh, make some cute things and just put them put them in and some of the things that I really like it would be nice just to put them in you know I mean like here oh gosh look at that it actually fell off because it was so weak poor thing I think I'm just going to trim and make it a round ball since that piece fell off. There's nothing I can do about that. Okay. All right. So I thought because this is a corner pocket that maybe, and I have two of these Rudolph things, I'm just going to tuck that Rudolph thing in there. And then I thought maybe I'll just go along and do pages. Like here I have a page. And um, since I got this adorable tag thing and I can write on the back I thought maybe this would be really sweet to just sit in there because see that's what I'm thinking if I just um, decorate up and I don't want to like see how cute that is and I, I don't want to cover up that either so what if I make a Flip so that I can still see how totally adorable this is. So that's an idea. So maybe I will take this because this seems to be the best washi that I have. 
Yeah, I want to be able to see the back. My friend Elizabeth gave this to me. And um, it's so cute. And don't ask me why I did it the wrong side first, but I did. But anyway, um, I'm just going to go like this. And then I'm going to do this tape right here. There we go. Yeah, I thought, you know what, I'm going to just put things in here um, that I've gotten that I really like. Anyway, this way I can flip this and I can put something pretty um, down the edge here. I don't know what yet, so I'm not going to put anything because I want to want to put something there, but I'm not, not sure what yet. But I thought if I just went along and did some of the decorating, some of the things I've gotten would be really cute on, um, you know, just as little additions or um, like this. This would be cute because this actually is for writing, so I could just put it like this and then I can... I can pull it out and write on it. And then I have this beautiful, I mean, I've got some super cute things and I really want to save them. And so I thought, well, let me see. Do I have some stuff that would work on here? I like that ticket. But I feel like it needs something, so I'm not going to put anything there yet. Um, here I could totally put something, so I'm going to put one of these ticket things that my friend gave me. A friend from Turkey gave me these. And I thought, you know what, this will be super cute here. So right now I'm just kind of taking the time and placing in um, some cute things kind of decorating the pages because these are things I definitely want to use and I, I really like them so I want to use them you know I mean here I've got a little <laughs> I forgot I tucked in the little um, and journaling card in here like right there and I have like this space, but see, I don't think that looks really great with that. And I have this, this might actually be a good spot for that or not. See, I, that's why I'm like, I'm not sure where I wanna put things. So I'm kind of looking at what I have. There's a, um, oops billy band right here you know so possibly something like this but I don't want to lose it yeah so there's some things that I'm not sure but this is so cute and I just want this to be like focused somewhere pretty that's for too white <laughs> So you can see I have a little bit of a dilemma about where to place certain things and what to do. And I, there's writing I want to do, but I'm thinking the writing will be best tucking in writing spot, you know, writing pieces. I think it's going to be the best thing. That's what I feel. I love this. How to be Santa Claus. <laughs> Uh, almost like this would be the perfect little thing to put here but it needs it needs something more so I'm not gonna not gonna do it there either so see I'm just kind of moving around checking stuff out I like that there so let's let's do that one and get enough 
glue so it stays. I like this here, and this is a pocket as well. This one's a pocket. So I can put some stuff in there. Yeah, I really like that. Um, this green is kind of a good place for this. And I kind of like these two together. And then I could definitely write around them. But yeah, I, I think I'm just going to decorate pages here and there and make sure all my writing stuff is stuff I just have to tuck in because um, it seems like to actually write in here on the pages. I've already tried that and it's a little bit difficult so I think putting in the writing pieces separate is going to work just fine. Okay so let's just tip this pretty little ornament that I got from my friend Elizabeth and I got this from my friend um, in Turkey and it does not want to stick very well down this one edge. Okay. Yeah, I mean, really, I just want to be, I'm going to be doing the writing, but I also want to just look through and see cute um, things. <laughs> cute Santa stuff and Christmas things and vintagey looking Christmas stuff. You know, like here's a good page just to put um, things on and like especially like right here where there's really nothing that pi that's part of another picture that you're not ever going to see the other part or figure out what on earth it is. So I think putting that here is a good idea. Okay. And then I have this cute little Santa card that my friend from Turkey gave me. And I want to put that where it can be like used and seen too. Like this might be a good spot, yeah. Because with the silver, that's really pretty with the silver. Okay, so I placed the things that I had. I, As I said, I've got a lot of um, journaling cards as well that I can just journal stuff in and put things in and, you know, make it pretty. And um, I'm thinking, like, I would like, that's so cute. But then again, something like that would be better off with a big piece of paper and then maybe put this here as long as it wouldn't fall out. See, that's my concern. If it's going to fall out, then I don't want to put it there. So I'm just going to kind of look around, see if I have other options. Not that. Nope. So yeah, it's kind of a matter of figuring out what exactly is going to work, what's going to look good with the different things. Like I have this great big journaling card that opens up and I'm thinking that page actually, or I had, where did I have that? this one see this would work here too because it's so big and then I had taken all these out because I didn't want to use all of them so now I have uh, bits and pieces of <laughs> journaling journaling cards to use yeah so I have to just figure out um, how that's going to work. 
Like here's a cute with the Santas. This would look really cute here. Um, that one, who knows? I'm just kind of looking at what I have actually got available. Kind of like this for that. Yeah. And here we could do something along this line or maybe like this. Because this has this writing too. Yeah, so you just have to kind of, yeah, I just have to figure out what I want to do. I don't think that fit. I have a feeling we tried that already, didn't we? Um, yeah, I, don't, I think I didn't leave that big enough for spots like that. But anyway, um, you kind of get the idea of what I'm going for and how I want to kind of put this book together so that it works. Oh, this is so cool with the Santa here. That's when I like to just like make Santa things like that to match in with it. Couldn't really get this one figured out, could I? Because I'm just not like, me, not, not really liking it. And there's another spot, and here's another spot. I mean, there's several spots, but I want them to be the right spots. And certain things call for certain colors, so, you know, you have to take that into effect. I kind of like the idea of having this pocket be the matching one. And here's a pocket. So we could kind of, then you could have that sticking up. So that looks okay. Here is, oh, this one. This one. There we go. I like that. See, when I go through my pages a little slower, I think I can figure out what to do. This is a double pocket. This is a um, another tuck spot, but that one I think is better for a Santa. That one is too pink. I could could do this joyous a joyous Christmas. Hmm. Then I just have a little bit left to figure out. Oh, there's some cute things that I really like. Got some deep pockets in here. How about this? We could go like this. Or even like this. Okay. So now that I've at least got the stuff put in here so I can... Um, go back and just work on that. Ugh, got all this Christmas stuff. And let's see, this is for Christmas Eve and I can't forget that I, that I have that for Christmas Eve. So yeah, I think that's good. And then of course this um, is also going to be, like I showed this, it's a writing, piece of writing for in here. It's just something to have um, some writing on. And I think I'll just tuck it in there. Yeah, so I, as the time goes by, and this is still going to last me years, I'm just going to put things in as um, I get them. And, you know, slowly write and really just enjoy this for many years. That is my plan. So thank you so much for watching and listening and everything. And I hope you 
enjoyed it and I will see you next time. Okay, bye.